Welcome back to Essex LFC Reds TV, where it's just finished at Anfield. The score, Liverpool nil, Burnley won. The 68-game undefeated record at Anfield in the league is now over in a diabolical fashion, really. The team were awful again. Since the Palace game, our form has just dropped significantly. You know, it's, it's just been terrible. Uh, he made some changes tonight. He uh, he went with Origi, Shakiri, Amane up front. Uh, Firmino and Salah were on the bench. Um, but yeah, it didn't really do anything, to be fair. I'm surprised, was surprised that Origi start, uh, started because uh, he hadn't really had a look in all season. First half, he had a few chances, you know. He was t at least he was taking some shots. He was... Uh, like he, wanted to, he wanted to have a go. Um, I can't remember what time it was now, but uh, he was clean through. Ben Me, I think it was. Ball come over, he's just kind of like, well, he's kicked it and he's kind of miskicked it. Ball's bounced to Rigi. Rigi, one on one with Nick Pope and uh, just hit the crossbar from about 25 yards. Uh, it's a bit unfortunate, really. It was a good solid hit, but yeah, it just didn't dip at the last minute. Hit the crossbar and bounced straight back out. But that was about the best opportunity that we had. We had a lot of possession in, like we have done in recent weeks. Uh, just done absolutely zero with it. Um, I just looked void of ideas going forward. It's ridiculous. The, the Robbo, Trent, neither of them could put a decent cross in to save their lives. Everything was just a mess. Second half, well, it nil nil at half time. Um, like Burnley weren't doing anything really. They just weren't they weren't really creating anything. I think Allison had one one good save in the first half. Apart from that, it, like I said, it was just all Liverpool possession, but just really without creating much at all. Second half, um, yeah, I'm just trying to remember. At the minute, I was fucking in shock to be honest. I can't even remember what kind of chances we had. If we had any real good chances, second half, but um, but yeah, uh, Burnley scored their goal. I think it was around 70, 70th minute or so. Oh, I wasn't fucking paying attention. But, um, yeah, the ball was through. I think it was Ashley Barnes. Uh, Allison's come out. He shouldn't have really come out, really. He's dived with his fists first. Uh, missed the ball completely and took Ashley Barnes out. And, um, yeah, I don't think it needed to go to VAR, to be fair. It was a blatant penalty. And uh, Ashley Barnes put it in the bottom uh, left corner, the goalkeeper's left. Um, at least Allison went the right way this time. Normally, he just like, sort of falls on the floor um, after the ball's in the back of the net. It's the worst well, bloody goalkeeper I've seen for trying to save penalties. But yeah, it's just it was just a shambles, really. He brings off Ox and uh, Origi, brings on Salah and Firmino. Again, just well, uh, it's just like a final third. It's just fucking terrible. It didn't really create anything. There was a miss it, I think, shot uh, from like Mane cross right at the end. And um, the ball's come back across and, and uh, Firmino's kind of flicked it in. It was going goal bound, but I think the defender blocked it. But it was just it's just a terrible way to lose such a fantastic home record. You know, you can go down fighting. I don't mind Liverpool losing, you know, that would never want to see it. But if we go down fighting and play outstandingly well, but the other team just is better and beats us, fair dues. But performances like that and the performances that have been since the Palace game have just been absolutely diabolical. You know, just look absolutely clueless up front. These players are meant to be supposedly world class players. Fucking ain't got a clue. You know, it just just trying to either they're either trying to play a pass the ball in the back of the net, or they're just scuffing everything that comes their way. It's just uh, it's just a shambles, really. We've got United FA Cup on Sunday. You look at our fixtures, February's fixtures. You know, I think West Ham away. Um, we got Man City in that time. We got Everton in that time. Tottenham away in that time. Leicester, I think. It's just ridiculous, you know. By the end of February, we could be. In massive trouble. Um, I'm not even talking like I'm not even thinking about the title now. Um, we just got to try and get top four. Just got to try and secure that. But there's so many teams at the top there. The gap's tiny. Um, no one's really putting a run together. City look dominant now. Man United are still fluking it. But um, uh, it's just terrible. 
Uh, it's just I can't even be asked to look at the league. I don't even know if we've dropped down or where we've what's happened in the league, but um, uh, it's just fucking terrible. You know, it's just uh, it's just shocking. You know, you are watching us beat dismantle Crystal Palace seven nil, and you're thinking, oh, finally, like we've been average all season, and then you're thinking, do you know what? It's actually clicking now, and um, you know we're going to hit January hard, get the easy games on paper out of the way, maximum points. And uh, yeah, it's been completely the polar opposite. You know, it's uh, we just look a million miles away from scoring. You go and Man United on Sunday in the FA Cup. God knows what he's going to do with uh, formations and players, but I it's going to be a struggle again. You know, I'm not even. It's not even. Like, you can't even think about getting a result at a minute. It's just the fact that we can't actually score a goal or create like guilt edge chances. Which is a which is a shocking thing, um, but yeah, so absolutely gutted. It's just oh, I've lost the words to be honest. It's uh, uh, just putting the highlights back on now, but yeah, it's just it's just fucking terrible, absolutely terrible, stupid way to lose such a gr fantastic home record. I think they said they were, we were three months off it being four years unbeaten at home in the league to uh, to lose like that. So that team is atrocious. But uh, all credit to Burnley. Um, they've done us at the end of the last season, got a draw. And uh, done us again today. It's, it's just ridiculous, you know. It's uh, Anyway, roll on Sunday. Man United away in the FA Cup. Come on, you Reds.